how to get around the NBA League Pass blackouts. So NBA uh, has their own online live uh, package. Uh, all the leagues seem all have some sort of version of that it's called NBA League Pass. And you can see on the on the website here. I'm mostly I'm talking about the broadband package, which is all online: computer, iPad, Apple TV, Roku. 140 bucks. Uh, it's, I think it's a great deal. I love all the a la carte sports, so you get to all of the NBA games. But if you get down to the bottom, here's the catch: it's not uh, there's blackouts in your area. So you can see I'm going to put in um, a zip code. You can check to see what's blacked out. So I put up a, a local zip code in my area. I'm in the Orlando area, so the Magic games are all blacked out. So I don't have cable, so I'm out of luck here. And I think that's really disappointing. Uh, the key to get around this is getting a VPN service. So you can see this map here, just kind of dem demo of what VPN is. See, uh, there's your house, and uh, you know there's your internet provider. And you make that connection. Um, and if you're going to get the League Pass, I, I assume that the League servers, League Pass, are probably in New York. So when when you make that connection to try to stream a live game, it knows based on your IP address of where you're located in the general area. So it knows I'm in the Central Florida area in this case, and so it knows to black out Magic games. So the key thing is is to get around this is to subscribe to a VPN service, which is a virtual private network. So so what we're going to do here is is basically make a connection um, from my computer to my internet service, just when I get on the internet, and then I make a, that connection next is to a VPN service, say somewhere in Texas, and what it'll do is basically put me on their network. So it's like a wide area network. So it looks like my computer is out there in Texas on their network. It's a secure tunnel, and then I make the connect makes the connection on the internet. In this case, we're talking about the League Pass, uh, and so. New York or wherever it is, they look at my IP address and it looks like I'm in Texas. So it'll probably black out maybe Mavericks games, but it's not going to black out Magic games because my computer virtually looks like it's sitting in Texas. It's a virtual private network. So that's the key thing. Now for this demo and this test, what I did um, was I went and found this Pro XPN because they actually have a trial version or a free version, but it's limits to bandwidth. So I just wanted to see if I could get Magic games in my area with VPN. So I went to this Pro XP, XPN VPN service and basically you download it, you install it, and kind of here's the instruction to create a password, you, you account and password, all this normal stuff. And once it's all set up, which is very simple, you just double click and it basically asks you to make a connection. You can kind of see in the middle there it says uh, USA Dallas. So that's where I'm going to connect to. So hit connect and it's basically going to make this secure tunnel connection out to Dallas so it looks like I'm on their network and if you see in the bottom right I'm in Windows uh, Windows 7 now it says connected to USA Dallas and there's my IP address so anywhere I go on the internet it looks like I'm in Dallas use Google Maps or whatever same thing it thinks I'm in the Dallas area so now I'm going to go to my um, NBA League Pass I'm actually this is just the trial free trial version because I didn't want to pay for this to see if it didn't work so I ran through all this so I logged in it's just a trial version I go to the Magic uh, Timberwolves game, I go to League Pass, so I'm just going to wait for it to come up. Now this video demo is going to actually um, abruptly stop. Um, I had a lot more uh, of, of showing the game, of how that it actually worked to prove, but uh, YouTube flagged my video, so I had to take it down and shorten this. But basically, League Pass comes up. I'm going to grab the game that I want that is in my market, and I should not be able to see. And you'll see the game come up very quickly, and then I stop the video. Uh, hopefully, I can get this back up on YouTube. Um, but just to prove that it does work, and there it is. <laughs> So just in conclusion, um, the VPN service is the key here, and this really should work for any of the sporting packages like the NHL or uh, Major League Baseball. I say shop around, get something less than $10 a month. You may have to upfront a year's worth, but it's still uh, a pretty cheap solution. I didn't have any problem with the PC and getting on VPN, but I did not try tablet or iPad, so I don't know. That may be more difficult. I haven't gone down that route. And overall, when you add this to the cost of the package, I think it's still cheaper than cable. It's a better deal. You get all the games, you know, um, and 
also having VPN service really is a good idea if you take your laptop or tablet to Starbucks or any kind of public Wi-Fi so that's going to secure your data and your connection and um, you know not leave you to being hacked and stuff like that